A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. This is how the birth of Jesus came about. When his mother Mary was betrothed to Joseph, but before they lived together, she was found with child through the Holy Spirit. Joseph, her husband, since he was a righteous man, yet unwilling to expose her to shame, decided to divorce her quietly. Such was his intention, when behold, the angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary, your wife, into your home, for it is through the Holy Spirit that this child has been conceived in her. She will bear a son, and you are to name him Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had said through the prophet, Behold, the virgin shall be with child and bear a son, and they shall name him Emmanuel, which means God is with us. The Gospel of the Lord The birth of Jesus Christ An aunt of mine spent a good deal of time on what I thought was a very worthwhile project to come up with a family tree album. It was quite exciting to see the finished project tracing the roots of various families that have become one through the sacrament of marriage. This gave us a sense of history, a sense of rootedness. How many stories were behind each of those names of our ancestors, some of whom I still cannot know. But of course, part of the experiences is to know the tragedies and the imperfections of our families. But even this, we have to accept as part of human life. There is no family tree that is perfect. Somehow along the way, through history, some branches were broken or deformed. Jesus, as truly human, also had a family tree. Hence, he was also rooted in human history. But part of his history is one of rejection by his own people. And yet, despite this, God still chose to be incarnate into a sinful and even rejecting world. May we truly appreciate God's love for us that He sent His Son, even if it would mean suffering and death for Him. Are you grateful for the family or ancestry into which you were born?